Aloha everyone, this is Max with Asian Geek Squad and we're starting our series with tips for the Galaxy Note 8. This is day one, today we're going to cover three things, live message, all apps, and create app pair. Alright, let's get started. So let's start with live message. To launch this, you have two different options. One would be just to remove the S Pen. From there, you can tap on live message. Or another option would be to tap the button when the S Pen is close to the display. Let's go ahead and select live message. Now from here, you have different options. First things, let's go over selecting your background. So here you can see your gallery and also you have solid dis backgrounds as well. And let's go ahead and select this one. And then you can move it around. We'll click on done. And from here, you can go to the color to change the color of the ink, to change the thickness, the middle button, and on the left is actually the pen animation. So a solid pen, which is ink. And then you have glow. And finally here you have sparkle. So whatever you write, it will sparkle. Now, you notice here, when you start writing, there is this trio of buttons at the bottom. So that would be the preview. The one in the middle would be the start over. And the one on the left, the left arrow would be to undo. Now you can keep doodling on this and you'll see there's a bar, which basically that is the length of time you can keep writing for. And it's very slight and it's right above the picture. So it's right here right now. And then if I write some more, you'll see it move further and here it is now. So let's go ahead and just write. Once you're done, all you have to do is click done on the upper right and it will save it. From here, it will be saved to your gallery. You can share this via text message, WhatsApp, Facebook, etc. And here, you have the share button and you have your, all these different options. And it's cool too because it backs it up on Google Photos if you have Google Photos and it retains the animation as well. All right, so that is our first tip with live message. Let's move on to the second thing, which is all apps. So from your home screen to view all of your apps, you have to swipe up and here are all of your apps. Personally, this is great, but I just like to see everything. So all you have to do, let me put the S Pen back, is hold your screen, click on home screen settings here at the lower right, and then home screen layout and tap home screen only, which basically means there's no separate area for your applications. It all goes in the home screen. So once you click apply, and I'll verify if you wanna do that, click apply again, pretty much all of your apps are now here on the home screen. Well, for me, this particular option just makes it a little bit easier to sort through your applications and to find applications as well. All right, and finally, our last tip of the day is create app pair. Now this is from your edge display. So we'll just swipe and swipe. And make sure your app edge is on. And from here to add, all you do is tap on these pluses. And here you would select create app pair on the upper right. Now you will select two apps. The first one will appear on the top and the second one on the bottom. So personally, I can see myself watching YouTube and maybe at the same time browsing something online. Click done and there you have it. And you can also rearrange this as well. So if this is one of your favorites, you can drag that to the top. And now when we swipe, our YouTube in Chrome is there on the upper left. All right, so that is our first tip for day one of our Galaxy Note 8. Definitely more tips coming. Don't forget to subscribe and like. If you have any questions, don't forget to leave us a comment down below. It might be a topic for our next tutorial. Thank you guys for watching. Aloha.